What is going on, everybody? Welcome to a new edition of Pop Drunk. I'm Ed. I'm Heather. And, uh, well, you know. You know how it goes, right? <sighs> another, yeah. another day, another pop. <laughs> That's I mean, I, what, what if you got paid in pops? That'd be... That, I mean, I couldn't pay my mortgage with that, but you could take care of that. You've been paid in pops before, though. <laughs> I have. I actually, uh, near the end mm -hmm. of my wrestling career is when I started collecting pops. And one of the promoters is also a toy dealer, mm -hmm. and he wanted me to wrestle, and I was just, I, I didn't want to wrestle yeah. anymore. I'm just like, I'm done. I, I don't want to do that anymore. And uh, he said, well, what if I get you? I don't even remember what pop it was right. at this point. Is that a credit towards the shop? Yeah, Some yeah. He paid, like, me, right. he paid me in Funko Pops. So, <sighs> yay. yay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Well, hey, thank you guys for all tuning in. You guys are super awesome. I appreciate you. I tell you that every episode. Today, we have, like, so much stuff. Like, I know we always have I'm stuff. Say, how is this different than any other But time? we've got mail calls. Yeah. We've got viewer mail. Yeah. We have Funko yes. Shop stuff that are sodas, which are also a mystery. Oh, okay. We have mystery boxes from Chrono Toys, who we yes. always love. And we have one mystery box okay. from Toy USA. Just one, though. Oh, wow. Just one. Oh. But before we get to all that... We want to thank you guys for liking, sharing, and subscribing. If this is your first Ding. time here, please make sure you subscribe and you give Ding. us a like and comment below. We always want to talk. Yeah. Um, but after you do all that, you need to follow us on Instagram. You surely do it. If you're and... not already doing it, do it right now. Well, not right now. Do it in like um, 10 seconds. <laughs> so follow us on Instagram and you can find us on Instagram at... Pop underscore drunk underscore. All right. So... Uh, weird, man, I don't even know where to begin. I literally don't know where to begin. Um, okay, so we'll get we some knives out. Knives out. Get some knives out. Isn't this that is... a movie? <laughs> knives out? Yes, I believe it. Oh, yeah. I believe I it is. I'll be honest, it looks pretty dumb. I've never seen it. By the way, you were right. I, I'm, I, yeah, like, on video. Yeah, I'm right. saying it I'm on sure video. For multiple things. <laughs> Why? What, what did I? What happened? Sarah Jessica Parker was the Sanderson sister. That's right. You're like, dude. She I, was, I, was she even born yet? Was she like, I, she was like a kid? I'm like, she was young. Was she? <laughs> I mean. So. All right. So there it is on record. Ed admitted he was wrong. It's got to happen once in a lifetime, right? Ooh, one to nothing. <laughs> All right. So we got a letter here. Uh, I'm not gonna say your real name because I. I in pro wrestling, it's still weird for me to use real names, can so... We, can we just call him Mr. Hayes? Mr. Hayes? Mr. Hayes, that's a wrestling thing. So All right, like, yeah. so... I was going to say, it looks like a, a birthday card. And it card. is. Look at this. Look at this Christmas? card. Is it birthday? It what says, it? not everyone can do what you do. I see stickers. All right, Ooh. but anyone can see that what you do makes a wonderful Aww. difference. Spew, spew. So, Ed and Heather... Thank you for the entertainment and great content. Here's a sticker for your table. Sorry it took longer than expected. Love, Divine Pops. Yay! So, Divine Pops, thank you very much. This is an awesome sticker. Um, I love it. It's going to go right on the table. But I don't have fingernails, so Heather's got to do it. Okay, I'm going to so. start spewing hearts at people that I love. Now. <laughs> I, I don't know if I know how to edit that in. I'm, I'm, spewing I'm... hearts. Oh, my God, that'd be great. Pew, pew. I'm very novice when it comes to to the editing. So thank you, Divine Pops. You're super awesome. Uh, I love the sticker. I love the letter. That's super cool. Um, right. You find see, your see, you look, find now, the spot. Now they're they're getting balanced out. So <laughs> all right, they're gonna have to start overlapping eventually. Oh no, overlap! Yeah. <laughs> all, right. all right. You're right there, dead center, Divine Pops. All right. All right. Well, first I'm gonna get my red, white, and berry seltzer open. Yes. Smirnoff, send me free stuff. Yes, and I'm representing the uh, the Cincinnati, the the home base around here. Mm -hmm. And then this is Ryan Geist. Ryan Geist is one of our uh, local breweries. Yeah, it's really good too. Very that... awesome. Um, Zango. Zango. Yeah, so this is like their... ale with apple, mango, and tangerine. It's very legit. And I also, <laughs> I'm sure I'll open this up too. But I have Cast, which is another local brewery. Oh, okay. And this is Nelly's, and this is Key Lime. See, I don't, I can't See, get man, into the Key I, Lime, I, man. I, I had both I can't of these. Do it. Like, is is real good. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna get stuff open because we have a lot. So the first one we're gonna open is gonna be from Funko. 
this is something you, normally I get boxes, especially from Funko, and I'm like, I don't remember what's in here. I remember exactly what's in here. Uh, it, I ordered. I, I ordered two because you. No, know, I didn't. You I did it. I what? should have. I should have ordered two uh, because this sold out in literal like a oh. minute or less. Um, but I was lucky enough to get my stuffs entered in real quick. All right. And I don't like these types of boxes that Funko sends in. Like I like the sorter. But yeah, I don't like these boxes. These are just always are seem so too thin. Like yeah. <gasps> Hi, Gizmo. Gizmo has made an appearance. Well, she made an appearance last week. I know. She was. She's the good one. She. She's the good one. The other one I've been wanting to throw out <laughs> the house. We got Dexter's Laboratory. <laughs> yeah. I mean, these things sold out super quick, and just his. His compadre, his partner here uh, in the Funko release, Johnny Bravo. These are two super. The Johnny Bravo one is is super cool. I mean, that's got the that's, hair going. That's the iconic look. Of yes. Johnny Bravo. So grown up, like grown up, I really didn't get into either one of them. Um, I mean, more one. more Johnny Bravo right. than Dexter's Laboratory for me. But it was real weird because like normally when the Funko shop releases like two packs and right. stuff like that. They're sold together, like in a bundle. You actually had to add both of these to your cart. Oh, like, right. they were being sold yeah, separately. Yeah, because, you know, I get the emails, but I don't go into Yeah, it. yeah, because yeah, no, it's it up just, to me. It just said it had two of them. So I thought <laughs> it was like a two-pack. Like, oh, okay, you get them together. Please. All right. So those were awesome. I did. I was shocked that they weren't a two-pack. I hope you guys got one, too. I know, like I said, they sold out in, in minutes or less. Um, even today on the Funko Shop, uh, spoiler alert on what day this is. Um, they released a spastic plastic that sold out. Super excited. Okay. I love it when I see spastic plastic sold out. It was TJ. It was a repaint of TJ, which is like the skeleton with the sombrero and the beard oh, in his hand. Oh, okay. So. And you know anything like that has to be in the house. All right, we got two more from Funko Shop. Oh. We're going to open these you together. Put it from me? Do I get to open a Funko? You, yes, you get to what? open a Funko. Because there should be four of the Freddy Funko sodas in here. Oh, gotcha. Now, I should have gotten six, but I hesitated. And, and Heather was happy that I hesitated. Any hesitation on the purchase of goods, I'm, I'm like, that was a good idea. Oh, these aren't even in, like, sorters. The WonderCon ones came in sorters. I'm so used to hiding the box. <laughs> What a mystery. What's a mystery to me? Uh, all right. So these are going to be mysteries. So we are going <laughs> to open these up. Can, can we make a little side bet of who has a chase? I hope one of us has a chase. Uh, oh, nice. All right. You're calling it. I'm, dude, I'm calling it. I get all the chases. <laughs> all right. So I need a knife to open these. So all I want is one chase. I, oh, oh. I And a regular. Oh. And a regular. I need both. Uh, for those of you who don't know, man, I am head first in sodas. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying the sodas as well. I think they're super awesome. I love the packaging. This is yes. just super cool. Uh, I love the little pog that goes in the bottom uh, to tell yeah. you what you got. Uh, are we going to look at the pog first? or are I we... think that's how it how it goes. All right. Uh, but yes, I have. God, I have so many. All right. I'll go first. You know what? I want a slammer now. All right, well, this is... Can we, can we play? Can we play balls? Oh, my God. Can we do that now? Can we go to, like, eBay? You know, because, you know, nothing is right in the world now. Can we go back and, like, like have a paw competition? All right. Well, that is a common Freddy Funko. All right. Here's a... Here's All right. A oh, God, I hope I don't have four commons. Here's a common, but not the rapper. Uh, <laughs> I'm just saying. All right. All right. Oh, okay, and so I'm not going to open my dude, because it's the same dude, right? It's the same dude. Same dude. God, I just need one chase. Just give me one chase. Aww. Oh, did you get it? Yeah. Good for you. Boom. Freddy Funko. Good. See? You got the chase. You didn't need to buy six. <laughs> there you go. Good decision making. All right. Oh, so excited. So excited. All right. So what's it going? He's like, hi. 
Hi, my name is Reddy. I'm wearing a double go drop. He's got the little, myself. like, lime on his shirt. Oh. I love that. But yes, I am all in on the Funko sodas, guys. I hope you he are like, too. He like matches. He matches <laughs> my beer. Oh, uh, oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Okay. All right, so Freddy Funko, we got the chase, we got the common. That's all I wanted. That's all I needed. And uh, that's the end of the video. <laughs> no, not at oh. all. Come on, do you think if we put out a 10-minute video, if they would even <laughs> allow us to continue to put out videos? Bang, you guys. <laughs> so thank you guys so much. And then uh, after you follow us on Instagram, make sure you also go check out the Funko Collector Society. <laughs> uh, a great group of guys and gals that uh, make awesome content. So, uh, all right, I'm going to open this one. Okay. So this is a single mystery box from Toy USA. Oh, all right. Does this mean it was really expensive? It was not. Oh, okay. it, it wasn't. It really wasn't. It was. Okay. I, I want to say it was twenty five dollars. It might have been thirty five. So All don't right. quote me on that. So what they were doing is, is this was basically a blind mystery box. It was like, I'm gonna call it thirty five because I think All it was right. a little bit higher. Okay. Um, no guaranteed value. Right. Uh, but the opportunity was to get a Planet Arlia Vegeta. From Dragon Ball Z, hold on. I know. Now, as you guys all know, we don't collect anime. But if I were to get that, which I'm not going to, let's be honest, guys. That's... Let's be real. I could then trade that, because I don't sell, I could trade that for something I did want. And it like 35 bucks. That's like what's the what's the loss? That's like the super oh, of the Vegetas, right? It is. It is the king of the Vegetas. Well, since Vegeta loves Heather, <laughs> maybe I should open this one. So there, even if it was the Vegeta, it okay. wouldn't be in the box. So because of its its value, value and its rarity, what they were doing is basically you would get a uh, a, like common a common pop and then like a within a sleeve. Oh, and it's like and then you get a hold of oh, them yes. and they would send you um, the Vegeta. You get like gold, like a gold ticket. Right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. So. I don't know what's in here. I It's in a protector, but that doesn't mean anything. It could be a $5 pop. That's what they said. They said, look, it could either be 5 bucks or it could be 3 grand. Right. Either Is that they, how much it's going for? Yeah, it's like 3 grand. And if you just tuned in, we don't talk about value because he says it, but yeah. I just said it because, you know, value just played into this. So. Yes. So, but whatever. All right. I think <laughs> this is the front. It isn't a protector, okay. but I think I think all their single ones they put okay. in protectors. It's kind of heavy. Whoppa! This 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 guy. All right, so we haven't started <laughs> the game yet. We, we haven't started the the rules, but I no. am going to owe an extra shot because this is the common Razor Ramon, which we already have. But because this wasn't a part of the normal game, we didn't count it. Um, but I'll I'll take an extra shot. Oh, okay. All right, so it's a great okay. pop, Razor Ramon. Uh, there's a chase where he's in his yeah. NWO gear. And I'm real bitter. So, they have a bunch of Hulk Hogan's, right? right. But the the NWO dressed Hulk Hogan says Hollywood Hulk Hogan. Okay. They have Diesel in his white Diesel gear, but then the Chase is Kevin Nash in his NWO gear, but it says Kevin Nash. The Razor Ramon, even though it's in the NWO gear, it still says Razor Ramon, which is upsetting. So out of all of these, is that the only one that we have? Because I don't think we, uh, we have Braun Strowman. Did we I buy think, it yeah. in the mystery box? Mm -hmm. So the other in the series is The Rock and Alexa Bliss. Mm -hmm. So all right, right guys. Since we've got a WWE pop. Well, we didn't we didn't score the Planet Arlia Vegeta. I'll leave that up to Sean Ryan since he's got all the luck in the world. All right, guys. Dun, dun, dun. The meat, the meat of the meal. Yeti. We got mystery boxes. We got mystery boxes from our absolute favorite mystery box company can, out there. Can I tell the people? Tell the people. We love Chrono Toys. That's right. These ah. are Chrono Toys Weekly Challenger mystery boxes. 
as you know, we say it every time they're our favorite, but also know that I don't know what weeks these are from. They just start piling up. So uh, it could be one from one week, two from another week, three yeah, from another week. When I look from the stack, I, I feel like you, you pick from the top. Yeah. So you can't really pick from the top now. So, so the bottom <laughs> is like the one from week. Like, yeah, nah. so I think these are newer ones. But if this is your first time tuning in, first off, thank you. You're super awesome. Yeah. Uh, second off, we abide by a set of rules, and one of those rules, never break the rules. Heather Ever. already gave. So if it's your first time, there's a billion YouTube channels out there that talk about value when they open mystery boxes. We don't do it. We like to collect Funko Pops. If a pop is cool enough to keep in the collection, that's all that counts for us. If it's anime, it's gone. <laughs> it's gone. So, but we don't just do mystery boxes. We do mystery booze. So, <laughs> mystery booze. We have the KFC bucket of mystery booze. Oh, I was like, why is it? What the hell is this? Oh, it's the, the back of the sticker. All right. So, um, Heather. Yes. Give them the mystery box rules. So, if you would like to play along and you have a bucket of booze or other booze or beer whatever or if you're not of age to drink then drink apple juice <laughs> but anyway so if you would like to play along three rules one you gotta take a shot if it's something you already have two if it's damaged or three if it's anime uh, if it's that orange box of hell you gotta take a shot that damn vegeta vegeta all it, right not if you collect anime, or, by all means, keep it all. We just or, don't. Or Goku, or damn Pika Pika Bon, Poke <laughs> Chew. <laughs> I don't care. Have you been drinking? All right, guys. Yes. That's all I. I'm do. still super that's stoked. All, that's all I do now. I'm still quarantined. <laughs> what day are you on? Sixty. Heather is on day <laughs> sixty of and not I'm, going to work. And I'm losing my mind. Hopefully you can like watch my progression, all these videos <laughs> of like her sanity is just <laughs> shot. Oh. Yeah. All so right. I've been cleaning out the cabinets. I've made more food. I had strawberries going bad, and I'm like, I'm gonna make a strawberry bread cake thing. <laughs> so that's in me. That's in you. That's in me. Alright. Yeah. I, I went to work. I go to work every day now. And I'm just rubbing it in. Just rubbing it in. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what we what we heard? We heard that um, we don't know when we're going uh, in the foreseeable future. Yeah, but you know what? What even the hell does that mean? Even if in the foreseeable future you don't go to the office, you'll still eventually have places to go when you're not working. Fine. Okay. Fine. All right, I got eight. Okay. Eight Chrono Toys mystery He's boxes. Eight of them. I need Heather you, to grab four of them. You're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> nope, I'm just gonna take. All right, you take those two. two. All right. Throw them down here. Um, I'm gonna take this bottom one. Okay, the bottom one. And I'm gonna take this top one. All right. So Heather's got her four. I got my four. I just grabbed all those stupid. <laughs> Pokey choose. <laughs> Alright guys, so, um, like we said before, these are from Chrono Toys. Uh, please check them out on Instagram at chronotoys.official. And you can buy these fancy dancy 1099 mystery boxes every Monday at chronotoys.com. Gizmo, you wanna say hi? Here, she's gonna say hi real quick. Alright, Gizmo is gonna here. say hi. And she's gonna struggle. She's so no! fat. Alright, well. No, here, no. No, 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 here she is. She's fat. You can hear her screaming. Oh my god, she's so fat. <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> She's like, lady, put me down. Just put me down. No, I just gotta All right. So you remember the rules. Good girl. Uh, but yeah, I've been paid to wrestle in Funko Pop. Oh yeah. So put that in your pipe and smoke it. <laughs> and in the and, and way back in the day, there may have been you know cigarettes. Oh, oh, and, oh. And, Let me tell this story. And alcohol. Let me tell this story. So one night. Yeah. Heather was booked on this show. Yes. And when she was booked on this show, the show, I, I kid you not, was less than a 10-minute drive from our house. I mean, I, we could have walked there. I was not booked on the show. No. At all. And this was the day of the show. And the promoter, I can't remember if he called you or he called me. Okay. But he was a man short. He was a man short and he needed somebody. Well, you know. I'm there to pick up the pieces, but he's like, Ed, uh, can I, can I use you tonight? Can I get you on this? I said, nah, I'm going to sit at home and drink. 
while Heather's out wrestling, uh, you know, he goes, well, what would it take? I don't have a lot of money, but what would it take to get you to work tonight? I said, all right, listen, it's got to be a tag match. I'm not taking any bumps. And I need you to pay me in two forties and two packs of cigarettes. Handed to him, <laughs> and I literally Kroger showed up to the building. And a he handed bag. me a Kroger bag with two forties of Bud Light and two packs of Camel Crush. <laughs> I don't smoke cigarettes anymore, but at that time, that may have been one of the worst rings. Oh, it was the worst. That broke. It broke in my match. Yes. Uh, I was in like a six man, and somebody took a bump. And the whole plank in the middle of the, the ring yep. just snapped. I remember, it was me and the little naughty. We had our <laughs> singles match. Because the, the padding wouldn't even go together. So oh, you couldn't it was terrible. Run the ropes. Terrible show. Because if you tried to run the ropes, you would like, your foot would go into like the hole. Realistically, Dude, I think me being paid in 240s and two packs of cigarettes was probably the highest payday of the night. So, all right. Pop! Hey, hey, we got Squidward. Squidward uh, Tentacles. I didn't know Squidward had a last name. Well, I mean, it makes sense, though. <laughs> Squidward Tentacles. Chrono Toys. Uh, we don't have it. It's no. not anime, but I pulled Razor Ramon. So... <laughs> it's like, what? Okay. But I pulled Razor Ramon. So, Heather, oh. please deliver me the booze. So that I can have take, a drink. So you will take a shot for not Squidward. Not Squidward. Not Squidward. All right. All right. Ah, you know what? I'm gonna leave this for Heather. This is that coconut rum that was sent to us last week. Oh, Go ahead and pull it back up. There, there's a here everywhere. All right. Son of a bitch. Maybe. All right. One more time. All one right. more time. All right. You gotta dig. I gotta dig to the bottom. You gotta dig. I already know. I know this ain't it because I can feel the bottle. Oh, in a square. Pow! Oh. Crown Royal. Crowny crown, crown. All right, Crown Royal Apple, point too. Point um, point yeah. See, you're so much better than your sister. She's just, she's just, she's just lying down now. <laughs> she's the best and really fat. Yes, you are. Ooh. You're the best. Woo! Woo! Yes. So hopefully everybody is doing lovely. Things are slowly opening. Today is the first day, because we live in Kentucky, but today is the first day that restaurants outside, like patio Yeah, like outside dining. In um, Ohio has opened up. So. And, and as we said before, Ohio, I could drive to Ohio in about 15 minutes drive or Kentucky. less. We can or drive I could drive to Indiana, Indiana in like 10 minutes. In 10 minutes. Five. Yeah, like so, crazy. Um, but the states around us are like opening up. So, and I think Kentucky's got, got some things cooking. Yeah, Kentucky's a couple weeks behind, which is fine, because they're kind of seeing, let's see how everything else goes. <laughs> so, it is what it is. I like this Squidward. I wish I wouldn't have got rid of the original yeah, SpongeBob set. That's hey. nice. Hey. Hey. Hey, you want to you wanna get down? <laughs> she doesn't know what she's She doing. doesn't know. She's like me right now. I don't know. <laughs> what the hell I want? All right, Heather Owens, oh, pulling out her first. Uh, anime. Oh, hello. Where are you going? What are you doing, Gizmo? She's she's like, oh, that's too far of a jump. Come that that's Gizmo, and because she looks like a Mogwai. And <laughs> well, shit. All right. Oh. Well, I have a boop Oh, Ooh. that's oh. cool. Okay, so this <laughs> war pig, motorhead. 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 We are motorhead. <gasps> Ice of spades. <laughs> Look. Okay. So, funny joke is, there was, um, it was a war, no, what was it? It was That's a cool. um, Mayhem Fest. Uh -huh. okay? Mayhem Fest used to be a, a metal festival that would come, it was a one-day metal festival. Okay? Right. It used to go all the time. And Motorhead performed. That was the the uh, concert that I broke my hand, because I was in the pit. Oh, yeah. So, I was, it was in flames, and I got pushed, and my... It went and I broke my wrist, but whatever. <laughs> but I remember our friend Kevin was there with me, and the old, I wanted to see Slayer, but I had to like make it through Motorhead. Motorhead, <laughs> and the only time it was just like Ace of Spades, Ace of Spades. <laughs> I'm not a huge Motorhead 
Motorhead. I love Motorhead. I love no, Motorhead. I mean, but I'm not a big Iron Maiden own. fan, and you Fair. are, so I love true. Motorhead. I mean, it's, I mean, Motorhead is just, they're fine. just about whiskey and cocaine and metal. You know what I mean? <laughs> to be fair, though, Bruce Dickinson's still alive. <laughs> Yeah, but Lemmy was 147 years old. <laughs> Bruce Dickinson's up there, but he still sounds good. Um, All right. Whatever. If you like Motorhead, it's fine. I just don't. Man, I, I get, you know, every now and again. I'm going to have to move you. <laughs> sorry. Oh, oh, sorry, Gizmo. <laughs> oh. oh, my God. There you go. She's like, what, 15 pounds? Well, Yeah. <laughs> She's a couple pounds heavier than her sister. All right. So with Chrono Toys, man, they get these, you know, I always talk about boxes and how <laughs> some have this hard corner here on the window and some have like this rounded one. Yes. Whenever I feel the, the sharp edge, yeah. I always go, ooh, it's in a protector. It's not no. in a protector. All right. This one's heavy though. I bet rounder, it's a Thanos. I think rounder ones <laughs> seem to be like older. Yeah. Well, it just all depends. Watch out. Making shit up now. What the hell? This is the oh, glow in the dark, venomized Doctor Strange. Because I know we were talking about this on the past episodes. Because we got another venomized. Yeah. And we've had quite a few venomized. Yeah. But we do not. No, have that I don't. One. We don't have that one. And uh, it's got the the overseas special edition sticker. I don't even know who this is exclusive to. Uh, I'm not a big Marvel guy, but these venomized pops they just look yeah, they're creepy. Really cool. That's super cool. All right. Well. Um, I'm glad I took a shot for Squidward. Yeah, there you go. Uh, because I still haven't had to take a shot because it's not anime and we ain't got it and the boxes are in great shape. It's funny though because the motorhead, like, it has like the weird, you know, all I can see is Triple H. <laughs> like, it was that WrestleMania that you know came what? out with the big, like, yeah. on the motorcycle with the big bra <laughs> thing on his head. My favorite was when Motorhead played him to the ring. Yes. Uh, and they were playing, you know, time to play the game. Yes. And none of the lyrics were right, like, at all. <laughs> There's, like, videos comparing, like, Lemmy's live set versus the actual lyrics. I mean, and it's he, just funny. He had a good life. I know. <laughs> I mean, he didn't give a shit. <laughs> That's the life oh. to live, man. All right. Get so, paid and drink. First Vegeta of the day. You shut your stupid face. <laughs> Watch ah! out! Oh yeah, he's taking shots. So this is Oops, the here's Pinocchio. Pinocchio. Giggity, look at it. It's got this. So oh. here's here's my question. So let me let me let me see that real quick. So you normally see these. It's over. Go ahead. You normally see these special edition stickers. Yes. On like European released right. um, exclusives, but here in the states they're always something different. This is a pop in the box exclusive, uh, but pop in the box is based in the UK. I thought so. Why would this? I, I don't know. Maybe it was another country. I don't know. But give me my. But we actually have like three of those, so you gotta take three shots. I enjoy the. Was it Geico? Yeah. Is it the Geico commercials with the Pinocchio? And it's like he keeps talking, and it's just like, and he's trying to get into his car. You have potential. You have potential. Oh boy, this is what, yeah. All, All right. right. I don't know. I feel like I should go towards the top to. Well, see those. If I can't those... find my. Uh... And oh, you ah! did. I'm gonna try the coconut. Largo oh. Bay. This was one we didn't have. Somebody sent From, it to us last what week. What did we sign? Michigan. I think so. I don't remember. I remember. I remember. I don't know. No, Minnesota. Minnesota. And then. The and land of Jesse the Body Ventura. Yes. Well, when he comes out of, you, you know, you when need, he hides. You need some help? No, I'm a little bit, because I got a <laughs> lotioned, a lotioned, and it's all right. There you go. There you go. First world problems. First world problems. I'm fat and I have lotion on. I can't open a bottle. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, it looks thick. Shut Get out of my head. Thick. Oh. Giggity. See-through stuff should not be thick. Giggity. No, well, no, not really. <laughs> anyway. All right, so we're going to be one to one. One to one. All right. All right. It's probably good. It probably tastes just like Malibu. 
It really, it kind of, kind of does. Yeah. Let's see, let's see if I can do this in one shot. Oh, I'm, I hope so. Mentally, I think I'm just telling myself it's Malibu. Malibu's amazing. That's all you, gotta, you do that with the whiskey yeah. and everything. Yeah. You just tell yourself it's Malibu. Come on, come on. the beach. <laughs> Ooh, the beach. Ah. Oh. Oh, there it is. Like a champ. Like a champ. What do you think? It's smooth. See, it's you like it? I like it. All right. Well, we'll have to put, uh, there's another one in here. Okay. We'll have to put Largo Bay on the. I don't think uh, I've ever seen that, though. Yeah, I don't either. All right. I, mean, I feel a little warm. <laughs> Go right there in the, in the ch chesticles. All right. Throaticles. This is my third one. It feels very light. Very, very light. Um, I don't know why, like, the weight should mean anything to me. Um, but it's very light. Which tells me that it's either a SpongeBob or a Groot. Because the Groot ones weigh nothing at all. <laughs> I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. I like the teenager Groot. He's such a dick. <laughs> all right. I don't feel a sticker. What? Wah -wah. Oh. Hey. Well, um, it's Gambit. It's Gambit. Uh, it's Marvel. Oh, oh that's cool. You can see the cards. What? That's super cool. Well, it's Gambit. Dude. Um, I ain't got it. It's I, not anime. I used to love the X Men cartoon. Box is in good shape. In the nineties. Yeah. It's like, yeah. Oh my god, dude, I loved it. And Gambit was my absolute favorite. Really? I love. So Gambit. you say we got to keep Gambit? That's that, that's freaking cool, man. That's like <laughs> that's like memories. Like I want to start searching for old stuff because what was it? Um, because we were searching. So I started playing that stupid game that you got me for Christmas, the Aladdin. So they took Aladdin. And Lion King from the Sega Genesis. If y'all remember how hard Dude. those games were, and they put them on one disc on the Xbox One. I was losing my shit because it took me ten minutes to jump from because these okay. Those games tested you. You because, were a man if you could play those because games. Because they kept like you know the steps kept moving, but the jump was so get glitchy like you couldn't <laughs> ten minutes, and I'm just like, I'm done. And, and you couldn't like, save. What? No, you couldn't save, and I'm just like, I'm done. I'm done with this. So. Um, but I do still have my Super Nintendo, oh. so I want to buy like the little adapter because obviously TVs nowadays they don't no they coax aren't, they aren't compatible with the old school stuff. So right, but I have all my old school stuff. So <laughs> that's that's what I want to play. I don't like these new games. All right, all right. So so I've been reminiscing. Why are you taking my gambit? Oh, that's shit. my gambit. Shit. My gambit. But I really like it. <laughs> All right, your second to last pop. That one sounded heavy. I don't know about you. To me, it sounded. Maybe, maybe it's in a. If any of these, if any of these are in like protectors, she's pulling it. Like, I haven't pulled any cool like protector pops lately. I've been losing my shit, but but I have good luck. You do. I have good luck when it comes to stuff like this. Sanity, not so much. <laughs> Oh, uh, we have so many more mystery boxes to come, guys. Stuff from Bands for Arms. S'more stuff from Chrono. S'mores. S'mores. That. Just... Okay, so <laughs> this is not a thing. I mean, it's not in a protector. Okay. You feel a sticker? I don't know. I don't feel for it. All right. Oh, yeah. You taking a shot. Because we, I feel like we pulled this in another <laughs> Chrono Toys. Like a year ago. So yeah, so that is the Shiva from The Walking Dead. Never even seen like the But in the This has got the special edition sticker. Right. The other one had like a special because it was part of like a uh the Walking Dead uh something box. Like uh it was like a subscription oh, box or something Luke, like that. They Luke call Ray, it like, something like that. One of those, okay. Yeah, but we have this. It's it, it exists in our we home. Did. No, we still do. Do we? Yeah. Well, same. Yeah. Well, come on. That thing was commanding quite a bit of money for a moment, and then it just kind of slipped. Well, yeah. It's it's all about timing. Oh yeah. But I didn't get rid of it anyway. Uh uh oh! Hey! Look at you! Look at you! It's she, number two. 
It's the same Largo Bay. It's the day. Hey, I can I can reuse the same shot glass. Look at that. <laughs> oh. Saving soap. Saving soap. You know, because I do the dish. Can you you, open it? you put can them open in it? the dishwasher. Well, some I do, some I do not. Actually, most shot glasses I hand wash. Really? Yeah, because just taking the, that extra step. Look, what? Because shut up. Because the ones that have like the stickers and stuff. Okay. They'll come off. All and, right. Uh, you know. I'll allow it. He he don't know. He's a boy. I'm a boy. <laughs> Oh, it's oh. still thick, though. Oh, so thick. It's still thick, though. Giggity. Ah. Uh, so, uh, Am I empty on here? Heather's gonna, Heather's gonna take this in one shot. She's gonna do oh. one show with two shots and one drink. <laughs> Fireworks! <laughs> bah, bah, bah. Um, guys, you know, I always feel bad. It's so weird. How did, how did our old videos where we only opened six pops go like an hour because, long because each pop we would drink and then you would get really drunk and then you would go on tangents that's that's fair. what happens because how many had shots have you had just one one yeah i'm blurring splurring and i'm only on i haven't uh, even taken the next one i'm gonna well, do it right we, now we might film a second video no, maybe maybe <laughs> if there's not a second video guys it's her fault <laughs> okay all right. All right. I got my I got my chaser. You got your key lime, and you got the power I of the Freddy Soda Chase. Yes, and the key lime with the Malibu because I'm ready for a beach. <laughs> Quarantine me uh, six feet of beach, and I'm all right. Six feet of beach. Mm. Anyway. Oh my! This is historical. Heather took two shots, back to back, Oh! in two drinks. Mark it on your calendars. Woo. All right. I lost the mind, but baby. So it's our last pop. And then I've got a question for everybody. No, it's not. Okay. Well, my last pop, I should say. My last pop. My last pop. My, my, my. Hey, let us know what you're watching. I need something new to watch because I've been watching a lot of UFO stuff. I hope everybody's watching. If you're a wrestling fan. Download the Vice on TV app and watch Dark Side of the Ring. Uh, I'm one episode behind. I have to. I have to catch up. But man, what a great series! Um, since I've been so emotional, I haven't watched it yet because I, 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 I can't mentally put myself in that state right now. So I've been watching a lot of conspiracy theories. All right, this has got a sticker on it, and I believe it to be another special edition sticker. Or is there two stickers? Ooh, is it a glow in the dark Vegeta Goku oh, mashup? Hold on, I bet it's another one of these. Cause you gotta remember. But is it a this could be though? multiple weeks worth? <laughs> so like you know, just because you don't get a double right. in week one, you mm -hmm. still get that pop in yeah. week two. But I don't know what weeks these are from. Wapa! No. Oh, hello. Well. Well. I mean. <laughs> It's fabulous. It is fabulous. And we love this pop. It is, with the special edition sticker, it is the Diamond Edition Freddie Mercury. Glitter, glitter. Sparkle, sparkle. <laughs> um, it's a great pop. It is not anime. It is not damaged. I just have multiple of them. So. We love Freddie Mercury. And, oh, yeah. Um, if you haven't seen the movie Bohemian Rhapsody. Oh, it's a good movie. So it's fantastic. I really fantastic. It. But you have the booze. You are oh, the yeah. keeper of the booze. Gatekeeper. <laughs> yes, and also on Disney Plus, we've been watching Prop, prop Culture. Oh, yeah. That's super so cool. That's really good. All right. If you like collecting stuff or right, any, on. like, things like that, check it out. Pata! Pata! Red, white, and berry. Mm -hmm. This will go really good mm -hmm. with my red, white, and berry seltzer. Yeah. Um, it's funny, though, because he had accidentally, he accidentally bought the non-seltzer version. So, all right, first off, listen, before I take this shot, because I love this shot, so it's good stuff, but there is red, white, and berry vodka, right? Which is just a bottle of vodka. Delicious, by the way. Then there is red, white, and berry seltzer, yeah. right? 90 calories, no sugar, you know, all that stuff. Delicious. Mm. So I went to the liquor store. Mm. 
And I went to go get a, a case of these. I get home, I grab them, I pay for them, I get them home, and I go to drink one, and I'm still not paying attention to touches my lips. And I'm like, oh, this ain't seltzer. This is like their mixed red, white, and berry drink. And it's so sugary. Yeah. And it's so just it, not good. It's so, well. I didn't, I, me personally, I yeah, didn't like so it. I had half a one, and then I went to that. Like, I was trying to alternate, because <laughs> I'm like, ah. But I feel like I'm just going to kind of give it to people. There like, you go. Hey, I was thinking about you and just. Have a drink. Just giving them to people on their doorstep. All right, red, white, and berry. Yes. It's crazy because it's like one is like almost 200 calories and the other one is like 90. And oh. as I eat my glazed strawberry it's so stuff good upstairs. When it touches your lips. Mm. I like this one. Let's counteract it. There's always red, white, and berry in the bucket. Always. <laughs> that's good stuff. Well, that was my last pop. Oh, yeah. It's my and now it's your turn. Oh. And then and I, I, I had a question. I forget and now I've forgotten my hey, question. Hey, well, it's, all, it's almost Memorial Day. It is almost Memorial so, Day. So, around here in the States, usually you have a grill out, things like that. Let me know if you're doing anything because... Social distancing. As of, per our lovely governor in the state of Kentucky... Yes. Starting on Memorial Day, we are allowed to gather in 10 or less people yes. so i plan to grill but we're gonna out. we're gonna shoot everybody with the hose just in case i know before people come into the house and be like let me check your temperature let me check it. Is it, what is it? I just okay shoot here's a beer i just want to shoot with a hose i don't know <laughs> so, all right yeah. so Last that's pop. what i'm looking forward to eight chrono toys mystery boxes eight of them. and no anime no anime so but far why why did you say that because i want you to pull anime okay so it's two to two Two to two? Two to two. Tiebreaker. Oh, it's rounded. Okay. Might be a little bit older pop. Oh, I, don't I know. feel like. No? Um. No. I don't even know this dude. Uh, so, he's a Dodger. He is a Dodger. It's, it's Cody... Cody Bellinger. Cody Bell Bellinger? Belling Bellinger? Bellinger? Be mm. Bellinger? How do you mm. say this? Kim Bassinger? <laughs> Basinger? <laughs> Yeah, but see, that's crazy though, cause yeah, it's like it, it, oh. you can kind of you can kind of nurse these a little bit by like doing what's, this with your your hand. What's the? It's it just like, the MLB sticker. Oh, I know, I know, but it's like the rounded ones though. Is that like a? No, it's just thing? how they come out in okay, the. It's 2020. So, sometimes they're just not perfect. Aw, 2020, when there was no baseball, the <laughs> one year that I actually win tickets that I get. The opportunity to get tickets opening to day. go to opening day. That's on my bucket list. Also, if you have a bucket list, let me know because I think everybody should have a bucket list. I don't, I don't care your age. I don't have a bucket well, list. You, whatever. I have a bucket list. So, on my bucket list was to go to opening day in Cincinnati for the Cincinnati Reds. Yeah, in Cincinnati, like, opening day is like a holiday. Yes. Like, yes. whether you're a baseball fan or not. No. And I'm not, the, but I was still excited to the, go. You go to the parade. You go to the game. You... Mm -hmm. you you don't go to work. <laughs> you so, call in sick. Yes, yes. And then, you know, you just drink. But, yeah. I um, don't know. Any, you don't have to take a shot. Well, good. All right. I'm gonna swig of my tap. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, you know, I was going to ask a question. Oh, I don't remember what in the world that <laughs> question was. I don't know. Um, went on a tangent with baseball. She went, see, I'm not day. even going on the tangents oh, anymore. Day. Talking about memory. I don't know, but it, you know what? You know what's weird though, and I'm sure you appreciate this. And me, I don't know how I feel about it yet. So yeah. we used to open six to eight Chrono Toys mystery boxes, Fact. and we would each take three or four shots right. and be just hammered drunk. Fact. You know, like Fact. I like my Jesus singing lead singer for Leonard Skinner, and I'm in the front row and I'm just hammered drunk, and. I know most people, when they open mystery boxes, they want stuff they don't have right. um, and stuff like that, and we are lucking out. Like, like it's been like two or three weeks yeah. where we haven't taken many shots. And uh, I'm, I'm looking here, though. It's it's an array of shit. Yeah, like, no it's anime. It's all random so stuff, crazy. which is... So, sorry. but I can tell you yeah. that... Um, we have tons of Bands for Arms boxes coming. 
we have we always have weekly challenger mystery boxes coming yeah. but chrono toys dropped like a 30 or 40 dollar six pack Ooh. um now they could be damaged right uh we got two of those because that was the limit you can only buy two okay. um so there may be some shots on that one so uh, comment below if you are in love with these sodas i love the sodas i love i i like super cute little yes yeah, so things. like uh, i'm super excited <laughs> that we ended up with a chase uh, i only had to buy four to get it um luckily i didn't have to buy six Ooh, <laughs> wait for heather oh oh, oh no. i know so we're gonna have a chase oh, no. roulette coming up what? we're gonna have a chase roulette coming up guys and it's gonna oh. be the biggest chase roulette what? ever in the world craig in the world, in the world craig not top what? flight security of the world craig not, not just the city but the world the world so when i tell you it's gonna be the biggest what? biggest mystery bar or i'm sorry chase roulette ever and also if you want to go back to uh watching a video of us with a chase roulette our first our episode, very first episode which was, was chase roulette with over a year ago was dr facilier that's a good one from uh hot topic yes and we bought <laughs> 10 i bought 10 of those it was gonna be our first video yeah. and it was gonna be great Spoiler. No, no chases. You should still watch it because it's <laughs> hilarious. And um, I just know my my friend Nicole was like, dude, is that Papa Shango? Can I get one of them Papa Shangos? <laughs> Why isn't there a Papa Shango pop? Somebody call Charles Wright. Right. Get us a Papa Shango and a Godfather and a comma, the Supreme Fighting Machine, three-pack Funko Pop. Oh, my God. <laughs> I think he'd be down. He, he runs the Cheetah, yes. uh, which is a... High class, fancy. I'm sure it is. Gentlemen's Club in Las Vegas, Nevada. Because if you ever watch, when you watched WWF at the time, mm -hmm. and The Godfather would come out with all them random hoes, the majority of the well, they time. They were strippers. 95% of the time, they, they were strippers. <laughs> there you go. All right, guys, so check us out. Eight. Eight Chrono Toys Weekly Challenger Mystery Boxes. The Eights of Pops. <laughs> The Five. Freddy Funko Sodas Chase Common, beautiful thing. Uh, Divine Pops, thank you very much uh, for the sticker and the letter. You're super awesome. Yay. Uh, make sure you go fo Mr. follow Hayes. Uh, Mr. Hayes, uh, Divine Pops. Uh, we got some stuff from the Funko Shop, yep. uh, Dexter's Laboratory, and uh, Johnny Bravo. And I think, and Toy USA. Thank you, Toy USA, even though you sent me a Razor Ramon. Uh, okay. <laughs> Shout out to local breweries. Local you breweries. gotta represent. And spend sm the money. And smeared off send me free on the stuff. people. Um, <laughs> local breweries send me product. All right, guys. Well, thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, I'm sorry there wasn't a lot of shots. Um, maybe on the next one. So, thank you all for tuning in. You got anything else? No, I love you. Like, share, subscribe, follow us, all that good stuff. We appreciate you. Uh, oh, hit me up if you know somebody's trying to sell a Black Hood Skeletor. Oh, Been striking out. I got the money. I'm ready. Make deals. Hit it up. So, uh, thank you all for coming out. Mm. God bless you. And good night. A peace. A deuces.